Hello and welcome to the Gradual Report. My name is so toiletless that when it needs to take a shit, it does so on a bear in the woods. What does that mean? It's Danny. Today we examine the human constructs of exaggeration. Welcome to the Gradual Report, where we gradually report. Exaggerate. <laughs> it's so nasally when you say it like that. I'll take care of this for you. Hold on a second. Exaggeration is a representation of something in an excessive manner. There are several ways that humans use exaggeration. <laughs> Example. <laughs> a little weird. A little weird right there, I know. Let's move on. Go, let's say- Let's say your- Let's say your college roommate is named Eric. And he or she masturbates every morning at 927, just after eating a bowl of porridge and bananas. Now, in order to manipulate or shame Eric into stopping the morning ritual of masturbations, you might exaggerate in describing this to him or her. Eric! Boy or girl, you can't be inside this room for less than 15 seconds without putting your penis or vaginas, whichever it is, in your fist. Your constant slapping of the Sarge. Or flipping the bean, depending on if it's a boy or a girl, is killing me. Killing me. Please stop choking the chicken or softening the peach, depending on if it's a boy or a girl, or I will die. You see, this level of exaggeration takes a once a day occurrence and increases the frequency to such catastrophic levels that it makes everyone feel uncomfortable. Just say, just say, just say, just say. Another common area of exaggeration is when it's coupled with sarcasm. For example. If one critic were to describe the television show Two and a Half Men as the greatest achievement in human art ever, there is, no, ne'er has there ever existed a show so completely full of wonderment. Such things said about this show would be an extreme exaggeration to the point of being a ridiculousness. You gotta be careful. You don't want to be too exaggerated. Otherwise, people think you're just lying. <laughs> An even more common use of exaggeration is to make a story more interesting by simply punching up a few details. That's all. The event occurs. A car driving at 55 miles per hour comes to a stop at a stop sign and makes a right turn. This happened. The exaggeration. A car driving 200 million miles an hour blows through a thousand stop signs, hits a school bus full of children, and explodes. And that explosion causes another explosion, causes another explosion, which causes another explosion. So many explosions that the fabric of time and space Space are actually vexed, and this scene is reset as if nothing had happened at all. The car just made a right turn at that first stop sign. <laughs> Exaggeration! Tool of the human species to manipulate, inflate, and sometimes entertainment. Use it wisely. I love you, Madam Lemon Drops. You join us on Monday when we're a little older than we are right now, but just a little bit. The bird. The bird on you, the bird on you. I don't know, babies seem to really respond to that.